Hello science students, welcome to slide four of our digital notebook about acceleration. In this one we're going to learn about what graphs look like when something's accelerating. So there's going to be two graphs on this page you need to look at. The first one is a velocity time graph. Just remember that acceleration is, is happening anytime the velocity is changing. So you need to identify in this graph anywhere you think velocity is changing using a letter A. You may or may not use all of them. Okay, second one down. Now it's a position time graph instead. So you need to find the place on that graph where's Where's the velocity changing? And therefore, the object is accelerating. And again, mark those with an A. As a small hint, these two graphs more or less go together. To give you some help, there's a video to watch on the left that explains some of the graphs of motion. And there's also a link here to a graphs and tracks activity where you can practice kind of making these graphs yourselves by changing the motion of an object. And then it'll show you the graph. These things may help you a little bit in understanding this. You can come back and answer these questions. Remember, it's not just marking it. You also have to explain why did you pick those sections. Why do you think those sections count as acceleration? Then when you're all done, since this is a note page, you want to write a quick summary of how do you know whether or not something's accelerating based on these types of graphs. So kind of give, if you were to give a hint to someone or explain this to someone, how would you do that? I think that's a good way to approach this summary on slide four. 